Let me tell you about how the Roadrunner was created. Mike Maltese, who was Chuck Jones's number one story man, used to go to Desert Hot Springs with his wife, oh, periodically, to take the springs and relax. And these, all these little Roadrunners, used, they were like gray little birds with long necks. They used to run around while they were relaxing at the pool. And he thought that would be a great idea for a cartoon. And when they came back from the springs, we happened to get together with them one night. And he was talking about this Roadrunner, how he thought it would be a great thing in a cartoon. At the time, I had never heard what a Roadrunner was. I assumed it was some kind of a rodent. And I was almost ashamed to ask, but I said, Mike, what's a Roadrunner? He said, well, let me show you. And he drew a rough sketch of this bird with a long neck and long feet. And I said to myself, how can this be funny? And I, then I said to uh, Lou Irwin, who was standing next to me, do you think this would be, make a good cartoon? He says, Martha, don't roll your eyes. You know Mike, he can make a joke out of a wet floor map and make it funny. And I said, you're right. And pretty soon on the screen appeared a roadrunner with a little uh, coyote chasing him. And uh, something that happened while they were making the Roadrunner picture, there wasn't going to be any dialogue. But Paul Julian, who was a wonderful background artist, happened to come out of the uh, paint, out of the room where he was scrubbing off his, his background boards to take it back to his room. And just then the bell rang for everybody to go out, to go home. And they just rushed out from every room. And in order not to be bump into people, he kept saying, instead of saying, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, he kept saying, beep, 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 meet me. And uh, most of the people just got out of the way. But Mike heard this, and he thought, hey, this would be a good idea for the Roadrunner to say beep, beep, whenever um, uh, he confronts uh, the coyote. And so he told Chuck about it, and Chuck said, let's get Paul in the room and let him say beep beep, which he did. And that's what you hear. You hear Paul Julian, our background artist, never got credit because he was not a member of the Screen Actors Guild, but he's the one who said beep beep. And years later, uh, Chuck was telling me that a woman from Iowa State University uh, wrote him and she said everybody when they came into the room wanted to know does the roadrunner really say beep beep and when I tell them no they don't believe me.